It's been five years since the idea to join CPTPP, as, as we call it, first, uh, first started, and now we have signed the agreement. This is the, um, it's the fastest growing region, the Asia Pacific. Uh, it's going to be responsible for at least 50% of global growth that we're expecting between now and 2035. And countries have been queuing up to join uh, this, this trading bloc. We've got there first, we've got our seat at the table. And it is, uh, for the UK, it's actually quite a momentous thing. It's the biggest uh, trade deal we've signed since we left the EU. And there's everything to play for. But the government's own assessment says that it'll only add 0.08% to GDP. I mean, are viewers really going to feel any difference as a result of this? They will. They will if they use it. And the assessment that we made it was a scoping assessment. It's just a very broad brush sort of static modelling. It doesn't look at so many things. It's not specifically about trade deals. We use it for all sorts of things. Uh, it doesn't look at the future growth that's coming in. And it also doesn't look at how we utilise um, how we utilise the agreement. And this is why it's so important that I explain to people how significant it is. If we don't use it, then it'll become a self-fulfilling prophecy. This is uh, a forecast that's only as good as uh, the way that we utilize it. 